Naval Ravikant is a famous uh, philosopher, investor, and entrepreneur, and I am sure you must have seen his tweets or other tweet storms where he does a lot of tweets on a particular topic, uh, which are linked to each other. And uh, the most famous was how to get rich without getting lucky. So that was uh, very interesting. And uh, this one is a collection of uh, various things, not just on wealth. So this basically is divided into three parts, which is uh, one is on wealth, one is on happiness and one, one is on philosophy. In the first part, he talks about wealth. What is wealth? How is it different from money? And then he goes on describing how we can create wealth, how we can put it on autopilot. He also talks about building judgments, how we can think clearly, how we can improve our decision making, how we can do it faster and a more in a more efficient way. So ultimately that wealth is being created in an autopilot and we can focus on other things which we are interested in. The second part of the book is on happiness. So first he describes describes what is happiness and then how we can achieve that ultimately proving the point that it is a choice and everyone can be happy and everyone can achieve this happiness so first when i read this book when i uh, heard about it i thought it would be more on wealth creation on angel investments etc etc on entrepreneurship because he's a money man but i was surprised that this part of the book i really like better than the first part so the part on happiness has really been is is amazing and it's uh, very to the point and it's very lucid and it will answer so many of your questions on happiness the third part of the book is on philosophy the meaning of life and the most in interesting part is on rational buddhism it is a very complex topic but the way he has summed it up in terms of his uh, analysis and in a very like uh, very less number of uh, uh, words it, it's amazing uh, how you can define that complex concept in in such a small space so that's great and that's great learning from all of us so ultimately it's a great read on uh, various important things like wealth creation we all have to survive so we all have to look for our future and ensure that little sources like these are there so the wealth is there and then happiness is the most important thing and it also talks about philosophy which we have so many questions on so ultimately a great guide to three most important things i would say and this one thing you'll realize when you go across his tweets his podcasts that this guy has so much of wisdom and uh, ultimately this book is great yeah but he also recommends his uh, favorite uh, books and he recommends a big uh, reading list which is a bonus and which is a wonderful thing for all of us who love reading so that's a added bonus for you all so overall it's a great book it's a very small book you can finish it in one day it's more of like a guide into wealth happiness and philosophy i hope you like this review let's keep reading mm -hmm.